Hey everybody, Kenny Chapman here, the Blue Collar Coach, coming to you with a message this month about projects and about systemization. And any of you that have been following me for any time know how important I feel about systemization. And I think that there's four key components that really go into building a quality system. And when we think about systems, that can be anything throughout the entire organization, or it could be a project, it could be a task, something as, as little as perhaps rolling out a new price book, perhaps changing your dispatch process, perhaps um, you know, looking at uh, going into a new line of business. We're looking at all kinds of different things, but there's simple ways that we can address these. We recently went through a massive project um, here at Blue Collar with our team, and I just want to share a few things that we really focus on. Number one, you've got to decide what you want. You've got to get absolute clarity and decide what that outcome is going to be. Now, it's okay if you if it changes along the way, but you've got to really know the actual outcome. What are you looking for? Because that will affect the system that you put in place. The other thing that we need to think about in the second part is overcoming obstacles as they happen. Now, you, some of you go, well, come on, Kenny. Why would I plan to have obstacles? Why would I plan to have failure? Well, guess what? You're going to run into things. The way something begins is not the way something ends. So we need to look at how can we, when we run into an obstacle, hey, all right, what do we need to do? You're going to learn things throughout the project. When we were creating this, working on putting our school online, we knew what we wanted. We started out, but then, oh, man, we had platform challenges. We had technology challenges. You've got to overcome those. Three, get your team involved. Teamwork is powerful. So many of us that are owners and top leaders, we think, oh, it's all about us, and we've got the ego. Your team is smarter than you think they are. You need to pull them in. You need to allow that to happen. Your project will be better with their input as you work through things. So get the team involved. Let them celebrate wins. Celebrate successes with you, which is the fourth thing. We've got to celebrate as we go along, we're so driven. Most of us are type A personalities. Go, go, go. What's next? We got this done. Okay, what's next? And your team's going, oh my gosh, wait a minute. Give me a break here. Milestones. If it's a big project, set some milestones. When we hit this, we're just going to order pizza for lunch or we're just going to go get a cup of coffee together. We're gonna, it doesn't have to be crazy big things like we think. And then we minimize celebrating the milestones along the way and then finally celebrate the big win. Focus on your systemization when it comes to doing project management, building these things, and your results are sure to follow. So until we talk again, ladies and gentlemen, have a better than fantastic day, and I'll see you next time.